about solving quadratic equation by factoring. So I have here in number 1, x squared plus 7x plus 12 equal to 0. Solve it by factoring. So first, factor x squared. So what are the factors of x squared? So the factors of x squared is x times x. Next is, what are the factors of 12? So think of the two numbers when you multiply the answer is 12. And if we add them, the answer is positive 7. So for example, we have 3 and 4. 3 times 4 is 12. 3 plus 4 is 7. So we have positive 3 and then positive 4. Next is equated into 0. So x plus 3 equal to 0. x plus 4 equal to 0. Next step is to transpose 3 to the right. So, a positive 3 will become negative 3. And then 4 transpose to the right. X equals positive 4 will become negative 4. The answer is X equals negative 3 and X is equal to negative 4. We have number 2. X squared minus 10X plus 25 equal to 0. Okay, again, factor uh, x squared. So the factors of x squared is x times x. Next is, think of a number. If we multiply, the answer is 25. And if we add them, the answer is negative 10. So we have 5 times 5. 5 times 5 is 25. Alright? So 5 plus 5 is 10. But we need negative. So, it can be 5, negative 5, times negative 5. 5, negative 5, times negative 5 is positive 25. And then negative 5 plus negative 5 is negative 10. So, the factors of 25 is negative 5 and negative 5. So, this is correct and this is also Correct. Okay, after that, so we have x minus 5 equated to 0, and then also x minus 5 equal to 0. Transpose negative 5 to the right, negative 5 to the right, so it will become x equals negative 5 will become positive 5, and then x equals negative 5 will become also positive 5. So the answer is x equals 5. For number 3, so we have x squared plus 3x minus 28. So again, factor x squared. So the factors of x squared is x times x. Next is t of a 2 number. If we multiply, the answer is negative 28. And if we add them, the answer is positive 3. So the factors of negative 28 could be negative 7 times 4. Because negative 7 times 4 is negative 28. And then if we add them, negative 7 plus 4 is negative 3. So this is not correct. And how about 7 plus negative 4? 7 plus negative 4 is positive 3. And then 7 times negative 4, the answer is negative 3. So this is correct and this is also correct. Positive 3 and then negative 28. So we have there um, positive 7 and then negative 4. Next is equate it into 0. So x plus 7 equal to 0 and then x minus 4 equal to 0. Transpose 7 to the right, it will become x equals positive 7 will become negative 7. And then x equals negative 4, transpose to the, to the right, it will become positive 4. So the answer is x equals negative 7 and x is equal to 4. Number 4, I have here x squared minus 6x minus 16 equal to 0. So first, Again, factor x squared. So the factors of x squared is x times x. Next is think of a two number. If you multiply, the answer is negative 16. And if you add them, the answer is negative 6. So for example, we have 8 times negative 2 is negative 16. And then 8 plus 
minus 8 equal to 0, x plus 2 equal to 0, transpose 8 to the right, so negative 8 will become positive 8, and then x equals positive 2 will become negative 2. So the answer is x equals to positive 8 